We're here today to talk about indoor air quality, and the reason we're going to talk about indoor air quality is twofold. Number one, 90% of Americans spend most of their time indoors. Number two, the average adult male intakes 3,400 gallons of air a day. So if we're taking in air and exhaling air, it's important that the air we bring in is fresh, clean, and taken care of. If we're going to spend all our time indoors, we need to look at a couple products that can take care of the indoor air. Indoor air quality can be broken down into four major categories. Dilution is a solution or removing the problem. Very simple. You've got a baby diaper that's making your house smell. Take it outside. Number two, ventilation. Ventilation is banned products that take inside air and put outside air and move it around. Number three is filtration, which is particles. We're going to talk about filtration. And number four is microbials. Microbial is the vast family of bioaerosols, commonly known as algae, fungi, mold, mildew. And the problem with these products is they continue to come back. In any type of most moist environment, whether it's moisture, cold, or condensation, which happens in all air conditioning systems, you have a propensity for microbial growth. Oh,